Speaker. Uh, I rise today to speak about the serious changes that Bill 64 makes to our public education system that will affect not just the 200,000 students who are currently in public schools, including my own children, but all future students. I want to highlight just how destructive this bill is for a part of the education system that changed my life, which is French immersion, which is at risk under this reform. Le projet de loi 64 crée l'illusion qui protège l'enseignement en français en épargnant à la division scolaire franco-manitobaine, ou TSFM, d'être oblitéré comme toutes les autres divisions scolaires. Mais l'immersion française est au-delà de ce que la TSFM offre. Je suis allé à l'immersion française dans la division scolaire de Winnipeg, et mes enfants aussi. In 1996, the PC government of the day adopted a language addition to the Education Act that stated that French immersion, French first language, and basic French had the right to expect funding, programming, and curriculum appropriate to students. But instead, we've seen that the Bureau de l'Education Française has been all but scrapped, and staff from the BAF who guarantee the quality of course content of French programming have been cut, eliminated, and it ignored. We recognize that the more bilingual graduates Manitoba produces, the better our province will be able to compete. But Bill 64 does exactly nothing to guarantee that the students in our schools will have a quality education in both official languages. That is why Manitoba Liberals believe we should kill Bill 64. It's not reform, it's yet another act of political vandalism by a government that knows the price of everything and the value of nothing. We owe everyone in Manitoba a better education system than this.